Yeah, she's a Chilean uh, exile solidarity activist. Yeah, she's magnificent, you know. Yeah. I okay. can't get any other Jewish person to come out here with me. As soon as I set up a banner today, when I was all alone, mm -hmm. this guy stops this van, comes out, and starts attacking the banner. And so I told him, look, you're being recorded here. He says, I don't care. And I said, I'll call the police. And he said, oh, you know, then he started to think. Sure. But, but isn't that security uh, protecting you a little bit? Not them. When the police are here, they, they uh, protect me. Okay. But uh, this guy, I had to, you know, engage him, you know, in, in a combat position in order for him to understand that I wasn't going to let him get away with, you know, destroying the banner. So then he left finally. But the Zionists are going crazy. Crazy. Much more than before, you know, now they're shouting at us, you know, they they realize that we're actually doing something. I know, they're attacking people everywhere. It's, that's why, like, you have to take care of yourself. Yeah. Because it's not going to last That's forever. why one supporter uh, gave me this, uh, you know, Good. body cam, you know, Good. in order to protect me. Good. Yeah. Good. Tell them to smile, you're being recorded. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And also, I have to, I have to be ready to defend myself, you know. I, I you know. They think that I'm a, you know, like a, a stupid pacifist who's going to allow myself to be beaten. <laughs> no way, you know. So sorry you're going through this. It's not okay. It's incredible. It's a, and that, but you know, hopefully the international court of justice will will say something. I'm not holding my breath. But, but hopefully. I don't know. I'm not so optimistic, you know, because when I look at the composition of the judges when they come in, you know, two thirds of them, you know, are white nationals, you know, yeah. they are appointed and they're directed by the countries that appointed them. By other countries that are committing genocide. Like, we, I mean, the problem is humanity sucks. It's yeah. not one group of people, right? Like, as, yeah. as, unfortunately, it's, there's no monopoly on, on evil. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Okay, this is what is genocide. What do you want to talk Can I take a copy of it or what? Sure. Okay, do you have a link or something that I can get? Um, this is uh, this is our uh, website address here for the Jewish anti-Zionist movement, the Jewish Socialist yeah, Bund. It's okay, we have to go now, but yeah, I'll read it. The genocide means that they they want to kill all the Palestinians. That's, that's not what they want to do, but okay. Uh, you know, irrespective of whether or not they're Hamas or not, you know, that's they just want to get rid of the Palestinians and make the Palestinians so afraid that they will run away. Where are like, they going to run to? Yeah, well, in 1947, they ran to Jordan, two million in Jordan, yeah. refugees. Jordan doesn't want them. No, they can't take any more, you know, because no, they have Jordan to... Jordan doesn't want them. No, yeah. No, Jordan doesn't want them to have it. Jordan took millions, Lebanon took millions. Yeah. Don't, for, for, for the last 25 years... I, I'm uh, doing a PhD on this. He has a PhD on this. Yeah. yeah. So I'm not... I wasn't born yesterday. I wasn't born in Palestine. I got no, no two cents here. We, we, like, we got nothing. So where, where are you from then? Uh, I'm Canadian. Oops. So... Two million. There was a couple of million in Jordan. Yeah. There is about four million in Lebanon. Yeah. There is millions in Egypt. They cannot take any more. There's no more. They're still living in tents. Yeah. Those other countries are also horrible too. We're not trying to say Jordan is better than Israel. They're, they all suck. All people oh, no, in power suck, right? Yeah. yeah. So the problem is they, they told people that there were no people in Palestine when they went and, and that they built it. What right. happened was they murdered the people, yeah. they torn down the cities, they changed the name of the cities yeah. to make them something else. Haifa became Haifa, Arka became Arko, Tel Aviv didn't exist, they created uh, Ashkelon, became Ashkelon, they changed the name just so slightly to, to tell people that there were no people there, which is not true. There were millions of people yeah. there. There were, yes. And they murdered 800,000 people in the 1948, in the first Nakba. This is the second Nakba. 1948, they murdered them out. And now there are 5 the to 7 million refugees. I'm a refugee myself, a Jewish refugee from oh. Poland. You know, my parents, you know, escaped from the ghettos in Poland and the rest of the family was killed. But I'm not going to allow, you know, the, you know, these Zionists, you know, in the name of the Jewish people to make, you know, another people as refugees, you know, because that's what happened to the Jewish people. And now they're trying to, you know, genocide the Palestinians. That's not what they're trying to do. So what they're trying to do is what are they That's what the Prime Minister says he's doing. The Prime you're, you're following radical... Okay, I'm going to ask A Palestine doesn't exist because there is actually no Palestinian occupied 
territories. They right now the Israeli occupation actually controls the entrance and exit of all of those people. It's what it is its own country though. It's, it's not it is its own area. And though. It's an area that is yeah. occupied yeah. by the Israeli government and the Israeli it's, IDF. It's not independent. So, so there, there, there's no there's no Palestinian state. It's not recognized there's, by the, there's by no the United States. There's no ca- country. It's a Actually, territory. What are, what are the requests of the Palestinians is to give them a state. Okay, but, but yeah. that's what they want. They, and so not. why do they have to attack Israel? They, they, they oh, because there's five thou- they, there were 5,000 Palestinian okay. prisoners. And Hamas came to take hostages to exchange for their prisoners. There are no... There, there were 5,000 Palestinian have to, prisoners. You take hostages in order to... Because Israel wouldn't let them go. Hostages. Yeah. We're not, we're not yeah don't say you. None of us is them. There are 7 million Palestinians. Who do not have the right to leave, come back, uh, work wherever they want, move freely, okay. because the Israeli Defense Forces blocks the roads and doesn't allow anything to go in or out. They can. They no, are no, not. No, they, they can. can. Okay, no, no, now go not. read. Now go no, read. No, how the, it. how the it. There's, there's a gate, and they can go in and out. They're not no, allowed. To no, go they're in not allowed. allowed. They are. He lived there. He lived in that. I, I was in Palestine. They there would shut down the cities anytime, they you know? There are no entrances in outside of Gaza without Israeli defense forces coming yeah. in and, and out. And go on the news today, Netanyahu said that even the border... Is it not like any other border? To, it's to not like any other border. It's no. not like them. Because, because you, you're, allowed to go, you're allowed to go to, 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 to the U.S. right now as okay. long yeah. as you're not a criminal. But in, the, in Israel, you can't go into Israel from Gaza unless you have permits Thank that you. the government gives that they don't give. You're not what allowed about to all do those that. workers that were working in Israel that then started the October 7th bombing? 34,000 workers that they're now in prison. Bombing. No, the workers didn't uh, they're in a concentration do anything. Camp. If you're pro Jewish, not a concentration listen camp. to me. Don't. If you love yeah. Jews, you yeah. have got to be anti Zionism. Zionism is a, is, a, is, a, is, a, is a white supremacist movement. Yes. White? Yes. White supremacist From movement. From the Ashkenazi Zionists. I've never no. been. I've been. Okay, and it's it, they have an elite there, the Ashkenazim from Europe, you know. First, you know, the, they had the German, you know, Zionists controlling everything. And then, you know, the 70% of the population was Jewish Arabs, but they weren't allowed into a power positions. They were just, you know, cheap labor. And then they used the Palestinians as even cheaper labor, you know. And that's, you know, and now it's controlled by a white supremacist regime. And now they're blocking the Palestinians, now they're bringing in Kenyans from Africa because they're even cheaper. Please do the work, I swear. Don't yeah, believe anything I'm true. saying. Please do the Googling, I, I swear to you. I swear to you. Zionism, the Zionists who founded Israel worked with the Nazis. Yes. This is crazy. To it's save their own Jews. members. 60,000 they saved in I Germany, 1,483 in, in Hungary. I, I'm Google this. It's, it's for Jews to be free and everywhere safe in the anywhere world. in the world. They don't need one country Not to be Israel. safe in. You they need don't, to they be don't safe need a, They don't need a Jewish homeland. Like, I don't need any homeland anywhere. Yes, a majority of the Jewish people don't even live in Israel. We live here. We don't have a vote. No vote in the elections. But they say that they speak for us. I want Jews to be safe in Saudi Arabia. That's why I hate Saudi Arabia. That's, that's what we want. I'm so sorry, but I hate all of them. That's why, like, they, they, don't believe me. Google this. Read this. Don't read. Read Haaretz. Read Gideon Levy. Read Anthony Lowenstein. Read Amir Ahad. They're all Jewish Israelis yeah. who are against the occupation, against yeah. Israel. Don't read the Arabic writers. I don't care. Don't read the Muslims. I'm not even doing that either. There's a lot of propaganda on both ends. But read the people who live there. Write, read Miko Peleb amazing people they're amazing they're against this and there's a lot of like it's just coming out now netanyahu's saying that there's a border with egypt that they control oh. they want to create another buffer zone buffer zone within egypt <laughs> within it's egypt within yeah. egypt like it's it's ridiculous i want jews to be safe everywhere in the world israel and like you said israel was founded by the british it was. and yeah. and 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 uh, you told me this and there was a one member of parliament in british parliament who said no we don't want israel he was jewish yeah and he said no because this is anti-semitic you want to boot them out you want to boot all the jews out of europe and give them uh, just that land that is the most anti-semitic the jewish refugees you know i was conceived in a jewish refugee camp you know wetzlau in germany europe you know pushed all the jewish people in effect into the sea it wasn't the Arabs they who... Did, they didn't want them in Europe. They did. They didn't yeah, want them you know, in Europe. All pushed out. You know, they wouldn't give us any any little piece of land they wouldn't <laughs> even give us, you know. And we had to go and find somewhere else. You know, my father had a sister who was a citizen here in Canada, so he got sponsored. But any other Jewish refugee wasn't allowed into Canada. Mm-hmm. Not allowed into the United States. Before the Holocaust, during the Holocaust, and even after the Holocaust, they wouldn't let Jewish refugees into the country. Mm-hmm. Only, you know...